Hi. Welcome to the Wix website builder. In this video I will explain what is Anchor. How to add and delete Anchor and how to add and set up Anchor menu. We are now on the website editor. I am going to preview to show you what is Anchor. I'll click on contact. As we see the site leads us to a section of the bottom part of the site. When we return to the editor we see a blue line that is exactly in the place where the contact brought us. This line is called anchor. Anchors are invisible position markers that you can place anywhere on your site. They are a useful way to direct your visitors to important sections. If you now select the menu and go to menus and pages. Clicking on the contact, leads us back to the bottom section of the site. To the right, there are three points when you click on them you open the drop down menu, click on the change link. When the link setting opens, we see that the link is directed to anchor, on this home page. And below we see that the anchor with which it is linked is called contact info. That's why a click on a contact leads us to this sector. I hope you understand what anchor is. We are moving to the second part. Adding and deleting an anchor. When we are on the website editor, we go to add. When the menu opens we go to the more and here is anchor. Just drag it to the web page. Put it in the position you want. You can change the name when clicking on the rename. I'll call this anchor new. Now I'm going to another part of the page. I pick some text, randomly. Now I will give this text a link that will lead us to new anchor. Select text. Click on edit text. Click on the link icon. In the settings that you open, select anchor. The page will remain the home page, or the page on which you are located. And to the question where on the page, we put new. This is anchor that we made. Click on done. Now the text is linked to new anchor. Let's go to preview to check. When I click on text, we go right to the sector that we marked with new anchor. We're back to editor. If you want to delete anchor, you just need to select it and press delete on the keyboard. Adding and setting up an anchor menu. Most sites that you choose already have some anchors, especially one page. Anchor is in some positions. As you can see this site has anchors in six positions. When you want to control them from one place, then you need to insert the anchor menu. Let's go to add. In the menu we select the more. We see a space called anchor menus. We have a few different designs offered. Get one and drag it to the page. We will see that anchor already has six points, that is how much anchor has on the site. This is automatically created. Anchor menu is also auto pinned. We go to pin icon and unpin this element, so we will gradually set it. First, let's see how they work. We're going to preview. When I go over the points, I see that on the left I see the names of the sector that will take me. If I click on summer point, our web page leads us to the anchor sector. But if I want to change the sector again, I have to go back to the top of the page and choose a new position. Now I'm going back to the editor page to show you the settings for the anchor menu. We have the layouts option. Here, we can set text alignment. Aligns the text to the right, left and center of the menu box. Then we have the option design. We can change the anchor menu as a whole or that we adapt our existing to our needs. We can change the color, 
change the text content, font, font size. In order for an anchor menu to be always on our site, regardless of whether we are scrolling the page, it's necessary to pin it. Select anchor menu, right click. Selecting pin to screen. In the settings for the pin we have a selection of the position on which we want the menu to stand. I will adjust the position with the sliders in the place that suits me most. Now, we see that the menu stands and when we scroll. Let's go to preview to see how it works. When I scroll the menu is in the same place and it tells us which of the anchor sectors we are. When I click on a point, the menu immediately leads to that sector. That's what we wanted to achieve. Thanks for watching the video, I hope it helped you.